packed all your things? Make sure you brought the onigiri and rice cakes your mother prepared. Don't worry. I have them all. The cleaning lasts me days. Take care of yourselves while I'm out. And make sure you remind mom to take her medicine on time. If running the store gets a bit too much, take some time off and wait for me to... Oh, Yoi Mia. Your mother and I got so worried when we heard that you were going so far abroad. We've never left the country. So we don't know how outlanders might view us Inazumans. Or if they'd even be willing to sp- Oh, relax. Outlanders are friendly and warm. Look at Toma from the Yashiro Commission. He's originally from Mondstadt, but everyone thinks he's a top tier guy. A mop tier? What mop? Oh, do you mean the broken one at home? I just fixed it today, actually. No, I said top, not mop. <sighs> you know, <sighs> we haven't heard this kind of friendly band. Oh, hey, you two. It's been a long time, hasn't it? <laughs> I'm excited because I... Many things have changed. Lots of outlanders have come to Inazuma, and lots of Inaz... You two have been adventuring all over to that, so you might not be able to understand. But for us, this is a... That's right, the Sokoku Decree is gone. Ah, oh, I remember you two. Word of your incredible accomplishments has spread throughout Inazuma. My daughter's a big fan of yours. <laughs> Come on, Dad. Who's never dreamed of becoming a hero? Oh, thanks. But I'm just your average artisan. But quiet, but if an opportunity presents itself, why not try to show your stuff, right? All right. Did you two come over today to order some fireworks? Oh, uh, sorry. Well, I am gone. Dad's in charge of making fireworks. You've seen how skilled he is, so there's nothing. Oh, no. We aren't here to do business or anything. We just happen to be passing by. Oh, so we're all here with time to spare? In that case, let's chat some more. I'm not in a... Sure. So, where are you planning to go? No clue. Huh? <laughs> I say that, but I do have a travel goal. But I don't know when or where it'll happen. So... That's it? No... Uh, not right now. Since this meteor shower was a long time ago, the Naginaharas were inspired to create new fireworks. Dad says that inspiration is a combination of what you see and what you know. Different people can see the same thing. Inazuma today is completely different from how it was in the past. If I can see this meteor shower, I'm sure I'll be able to come up with a new kind of- I know, right? Of course, my main reason is that I want- No need to be shy about it. You gotta play hard when you get- You know, you're right, Paimon. Is it just me, or have you gotten wiser since we first met? <laughs> Paimon loves being friends with you since you say such nice things. Sumeru. I've heard of it. It has a ton of trees, a super impressive school. Yep, and everyone there is really smart, so Paimon's sure you'll get some answers from- Really? But- won't research people make fun of me or something? We won't know if something's real or not unless we ask. Don't worry, we got... Well, he does anyway. Wouldn't I be taking up your time, though? I doubt this is in your schedule. Exactly! Relax, Yoimiya. <laughs> All right! Dad! You can have more peace of mind now that... Hmm? Oh, uh, yes! You're... Remember! You two also need to take care of yourself. Okay, let's head. So, this is Sumeru? That tree's huge! Is the port in this place is amazing! It's way bigger than Rito's port! 
there are also a lot more... Oh, there's more cool stuff for you to see. Don't you worry. This place is awesome. I had heard people describe it, but nothing beats it. If I hadn't seen the port with my own eyes, I could never have a... So, the school you were talking about. The... Uh, nope. We have to head north from here and follow the river to reach Sumeru City. Sumeru City, huh? I guess it's even more impressive than here. Looking forward to it. <laughs> Whatever the case, why don't we go to... Oh, I'm so excited that I don't even know what I should... The important thing about going on a trip is to enjoy yourself. You don't have to think so hard. I'm just worried that if we don't get down to business soon, we'll take up too much of your time. <laughs> but if you insist, then let's look around. Welcome to Akara Crafts. Feel free to have a look around. Wow, what are these? This is our current bestseller, the Aranara Cart. Their designs are based on the fairy tales that circulate amongst children. So, miss, are you from Inazuma? Oh, this would be. Oh, I know about Aranara. You two told me about them on the ship. I didn't think they'd be so. Oh, they're all so pretty. Let me. I'm a new Yoimiya would like this guy, but even she might have a hard time seeing a real Aranara. Yeah, sorry, Yoimiya. But we need to keep our pets set. Paimon doesn't think Yoimiya would mind. Her world's already chock full of imaginary creatures. I think I'll get this one. Ooh, that one. And the other two that you showed me earlier. Uh. You're buying that? Yep. I'm going to give them out to Psyche and the others. They're going to love them. Oh, and these carvings can also... They'd also look great lined up by the window. Think about it. You wake up, and the first thing you see are when they brighten up your entire day. <laughs> okay, thanks. In that case... Hmm. For some reason... Paimon thinks it kind of looks like you, Yoi. Now that you mention it, it kind of... Hello, Nara Paimon. My name is Aramia. Is that how they talk? Hope I remember correctly. That was really good. Wow, great memory. Well, that's because they're so interesting. I'm pretty good at remembering those kinds of things. Of course. Thank you for your patronage. You all are an entertaining bunch. Or, or a All right, let's get to it. Wow. This market is even busier than the one in Port Ormos. This is Treasure Street. Up from here is the Academia. Oh, and in that tree trunk is the Grand Bazaar. They're both pretty special. I just saw a group of people come down, and they were all wearing the same outfit. That's right. They also wear hats with different designs, depending on which Darsh. For example, we'll be looking for someone from Watalahist. They know a lot about st Does this mean that you need uniforms like those to get in and out of the Academia? Uh... Paimon doesn't think so. Um, won't we stick out if we go in like this? So even you could... No, no, that's not what I meant. <sighs> Let's pretend you're an academia student. Then in comes a bunch of outlanders in strange clothes who gawk and run around him. Oh, Paimon kind of gets what you mean. I don't think we have to be too self-conscious, but it's still... So Why don't we look around here first? I've been wanting to see the Zubair Theater anyway. As for the academia... Let's go once I get myself a set of Sumeru-style clips. All right, but Paimon thinks you're overthinking it. Nilu might have some good recommendations. <laughs> Sounds good. If we can watch a performance of hers while we're at it, that'd be even better. All right, I'll be looking around here. I'm leaving the meteor shower. No problem. We'll be right...
Now that Paimon... Paimon thinks Alhaitha might know something, but... Oh, why don't we just ask around? Maybe... Looks like you two are in the pickle. Why not consult someone who always tells you everything she knows? <gasps> Nahida! Oh, why are you here? I'm here to meet with some researchers, but when I saw you two looking so... Looks like I showed up just... Okay, we might as well tell you. We haven't... Hmm, I see. Uh, your face says that it's gonna be a long time... Um... My answer is clean. You may have heard that the stars are related to people's fi- Yeah, lots of times. If the stars dictate destiny, then do you think that destiny is something that is unchanging? Yeah, you have a point. According to current Ritala Hist research, a meteor shower is a celestial phenomenon that it, their appearance is highly random. Some have tried coming up with ways to predict their occurrence, this is a far cry from folk tales that claim meteor showers come at certain times, and bless all. So, you mean we won't? <sighs> I'm sorry to disappoint. If we tell this to Yoimiya, she'll be so disappointed. What now? There has to be. Are you two okay? <laughs> Paimon just thinks this isn't fair to Yoimiya. I get it. From how you described her, I can see that she is a kind and caring soul. So, why don't we take a page out of her book and protect her dreams with... Oh? How do we do... It'll be a story about a meteor shower. You'll accompany her on a brief journey, do a bit of work... Oh, well... I can't summon a real meteor shower, but if... Oh, that would be great, Nahida! Compared to what you've done for me, this is not... Use the meteor shower as a pretext to take you and me all around Sumeru. Then, when you're ready, blow this. I'll tell the Aranara in advance. Once they hear the whole story and... Huh? Then the dream will probably be like the one we had in the video. That was a real shocker. It was hard to tell that we were even in a dream. Once the meteor shower ends and you all awaken from the dream, she'll probably... If you tell her the truth at that point, she should be a lot... Mm-hmm. Paimon thinks this is the best way to simulate the meteor... <laughs> You're well. Still, you two should get this story straight before you join up with your friend. If not, she's gonna see right through everything. True. Let's discuss it on the way. So what we need to do is to make you and Mia believe that the meteor shower is really happening and be super convincing at how we sell it. Hmm. If Paimon wanted to go see a meteor shower, the things Paimon would... F yes, exactly! We'll say we're trying to figure these two things out, but we'll actually be bringing Yoimiya around to see the sight. Oh, well, easier said than done. We oh, it'd be best if we could take a unique approach to making it fantastical, just like a real fairy tale. Hmm, this is... Oh, that's right. Um, don't people... If we used wishes as the center of our story... Whoa, that sounds great! All right then, we need a specific wishing spot or else the sky would be full of meteor showers. And then, what? <laughs> this is she- After all, the device can be anything and the location can be wherever. As long as we get you and Mia to enter the- There's nothing wrong with that! You should know- <sighs> All right, all right, let's go. You and Mia's probably sick of waiting for us.
so much. If it weren't for your help, I would have gotten lost already. It's no problem. I'll be heading home then. Just a minute, wait. This is for you. This is an r, &R carving I bought in Port Ormos. I heard it's- It's all right. I didn't do much, really. It's fine. Take it. You can display it at home or hang it on your wheelchair. It'll cheer you up. That might sound silly to you. Like, why do you have to be happy just be- But that's the magic of a smile. If you don't believe me, try it. Look Actually, I feel like I already do. You love talking, and you love smi- I just don't understand why you're so- Sorry, I'm not very good with work. Want me to take you home? It's okay. Oh, great timing, you two. Who was that kid? Oh, her? Her name is Abine. I saw that she was looking quite forlorn, so I wanted to... She was pretty shy at first, but I explained that I just arrived in Sumeru, and had... She agreed and we made our way back. There were so many paths here, and they're all twisty, turny, and up and down. It's hard navigating. No, she didn't want to talk about that, and I didn't ask. I get the feeling that... But, if I had to guess, it's probably because she hasn't been able to explore the city for quite some time. All she said was that she's sick and doesn't know when she'll get better. Whenever we passed by busy crowds, she kept... But, when I caught a glimpse in her eyes, I only saw yearning and a deep... It's hard not to be down when something like that happens. At first, she didn't really want to say anything to me at all. She just gave me yes, but what I really saw was just enough... Eventually, I think I earned her trust. <laughs> I say that, but honestly, you two probably caught the majority of what she said. Eh, gotta start somewhere. Oh, by the way, did you kiss Luna? You bet we did. Big time. You're in luck, Yoimiya. You'll be able to see the- Really? <laughs> That's great. If I had gone looking for it myself, huh? Uh, what do you mean? They respond to wishes? Huh. So, it's not that you wish upon shooting stars, but <laughs> in that case, I was born ready. Are you talking about how you want to use the meteor shower? That's why I'm here, but I wouldn't call that my wish. I don't think that alone will call the stars down for us. But, yeah, that would... Wow, she's adding her own spin onto this. If that's the case, then we'll have to practice wishing a little. Can you two come with me? Let me put my thoughts together and as for what my wish is... <laughs> it's a secret for now. Yeah, and we'll take the opportunity to show you some views you've- More places to see? Is that what you two were talking about? Well, wait, it's not going to suddenly start. Relax, it's completely still. That's true, it's green from all the overgrowth on it. All right, let's go. <laughs> Wondering, have you seen your sister yet? Yep, but she said that she'd meet us at the end of our journey. And then she left. I see. It seems she has her own things to worry about. But it's alright. At least you were able to talk. How did she look? Is she doing well? Had she changed in any way? Well, according to him, nothing's really changed. He's 
thing in it now. <laughs> that sure is reassuring. I believe that you two will come to an understanding once your journey is over. You are siblings, after all. fun and almost before I left Inazuma, many people heard that I was looking for a meteor shower. So they told I told them that they could write their wishes down on paper. So I ended up collecting Whoa! That many? That's part of it, but more importantly, I've been wondering why people link meteor shower. After a lot of thought, I think I people use fireworks to remember their most precious memory. In other words, firework and shooting stars make people think of wishes. Because wishes carry people's brute. One represents the past, and the other the future. They both- It's really beautiful, isn't it? It's clear to me that I'm not the only one holding this belief. I'm sure my- I think that's how he drew inspiration from the meat. His method was a wish of sorts to begin with. To join the past and future together and combine their beauty. At first, I wasn't completely serious about- But it became something like a mission once- You and me, uh... And here Paimon thought you needed practice. Huh? Uh, that was fine. You both understand what I'm trying to say? Honestly, I thought it was pretty messy. I mean, these are all abstract topics that evoke a... Traveler? I did consider that possibility. And I won't lie. I know that's the most realistic conclusion. And it's not like luck, but there's a premise to every legend. If I didn't take the step, it's not like a meteor shower would just rain. I wouldn't be where I am now. I wouldn't have known that they respond to wishes, and I wouldn't have seen all these pew So I'm looking forward to the rest of our journey. Every- You really are amazing, Yoimiya. Uh, what? Oh, nothing. Paimon just thinks you're doing a good job with the wishes. Now we- Like we said earlier, we're gonna need to build a device. Yep, and once we use it to create an observation device, we can find- I see. The purest ore. Hmm. Then, why don't we go back to Sumer? I chatted with him a bit when Avin was showing me around. He seems really knowledgeable. Uh, but- No one knows more about ore than- uh, that's true. Let's go! <laughs> I what are we gonna do? If we really ask the blacksmith, he's gonna give us funny looks for sure! <sighs> You're right. At first, Paimon felt bad about me, but now, it feels like we made the right decision. Yep, that's why we're doing all this. You want to use the purest material to create a star observation device? Huh. However, purest material is too vague. It'd be better if you were more... Firstly, this all sounds rather, uh, strange. I never heard that le... Sorry for the trouble, but we are kind... Sorry, Inazuma's pretty far, so maybe some key information... Still, I want to at least give it a shot, even though the information's vague... Well, sure. Why don't I use some materials that might fit the bill and create up a... That'd be great! Thanks so... No need to be so polite. You're my customer. Also the... Maybe we can just pick a random one. It's not like we're... 
<sighs> no, that won't do. I don't think- If these were for ordinary use, then it'd be acceptable. Barely. <laughs> Don't worry too much about the material. If you think it'll be difficult to obtain, I want to try all our options. Hmm. Since we're on the topic of legends, allow me to tell you one about- All of us in Sumeru know about this legendary forging material. Using it to forge something is every blacksmith's dream. Some spend their entire lives searching for this material in vain. While others have it in their possession, yet- Huh? What? That's because the material is too precious. Many believe themselves unworthy to work. In other words, not only does it represent the pinnacle of material quality, I constantly practice and hone myself so when I do encounter this material, we won't pass each other by. So you mean that it symbolizes dreams, inspiration, obsession, fo- We call it Earthstone. But in truth, neither I nor my call it's more like a goal. This fits perfectly with the tale of the meteor sh Then why don't we go looking for it? Uh, is it even something we can find? Exactly! We're chasing down a legend after all. What's true or not doesn't matter as much. If we do find it, that's a big win for us. And if we don't... When you put it like this... Hey, excuse me. If I might intrude, have you seen a child in a wheelchair? Yeah, she and I were hanging out not that long ago. Do you know where she went? She hasn't returned home yet. Huh? I wonder why. When we oh dear, I'm sorry if I seem worked up. She's been depressed ever since she fell ill and was forced to use a wheelchair. I if she does something reckless because she's not in a good state- It's okay, don't worry. Well, I can't say that I know her very well, but I think she just has a lot on her- That's reassuring. <sighs> she doesn't want to tell me anything, probably because- But I can't tell what she's thinking if we don't communicate. I'm worried that I'll panic and make things worse by- Don't worry. I'm sure she has a reason for wanting some space to herself. But that does bring me to a question I've been mulling over in my head. Do you think there's something else going on? Not that I'm aware of. I just know the illness. She's always been physically active. She absolutely loved to run and jump. But after she became ill, she lost strength in both. We've consulted with countless doctors. She believes that her legs will- Okay. I understand. I'll find a way to bring her around. Sorry, but it looks like we'll have to put her meteor shower cert. We're coming with you! Mr. Blacksmith, do you remember seeing a child in a wheelchair? Sorry, afraid not. I've been keeping my- But you're looking for someone. I said, he's my supplier. If anyone's aware of the comings and goings in Treasure Street- Do you know where we can find him? He's probably resting just over there. It's not far. Got it. Thanks for your help with it. We'll go over there and see what we can find out. Thank you so much. He and I will continue. If you find her, please. Hmm. Now that you mention it, that does ring a bell. I was moving s I asked if she needed help, but she didn't respond. Sounds like there really was something. Yeah, that was the impression I got too. Yes, so we're looking- I see. That's rather worrying. I- She went that way. If you ask people as you go, hope- Okay, thanks. If you find out anything, don't forget to tell the people with the green scar. <laughs> you mean the core of 30. Don't worry.
looking for? Oh, I remember her. I asked her what she was doing. It's my job, after all. That seems a little weird. Whatever the case, she left the city. If you follow... Gotcha. Thank... Did a child in a wheelchair pass this way? A wheelchair? I didn't get a good look, but something going pretty fast went sliding down that slope over there. Oh no, how teeny- For sure. There's terrain of all sorts outside the city. And if that was the kid- Got it. It was over there, right? Let's move out. I can't move around without it. It's okay. You're okay. I'll take care of her. Can you two look for her wheelchair? No problem. All right, we're in luck. Looks like the wheelchair's still working. That's good. Or else my family would have... You feeling any better? I know that... Mm. It's all right. You're safe now. We'll bring you back. Uh... Do you feel okay telling me why you had to come here? Just... If you don't want anyone else to know, we'll definitely keep it... That's right! You can trust us! The Aranara carving. My bestest friend. The carving? You mean the one I gave you? Yeah. My illness is really... I used to love running. I loved the feeling it gave me. But the longer I sit, the cloudier those memories get. I'm starting to forget how it feels to love some... But when I saw that wood carving, I remembered that... I w Wait! Was he an Aranara? Um, Paimon meant that it couldn't have been an Aranara, right? They're just- But they aren't! They're real! Hey, I understand. Okay, let's calm down. Sorry, I got carried away. And I don't have any evidence to show- Everyone says you can't see Aranara anymore once you become an adult. You- I can't remember his name. Or- how he looked like. And soon, I don't want to become an adult. Not like- I understand now. When you saw that carving, you were reminded you came out here to look for him and remember that friendship. No matter how- Yes. I, I want to see him. I want to tell him that I'm, I'm not angry- Cheer up. Something beautiful- Beautiful? That's right. You remembered something about the Aranara. Once you start remembering more things, you'll be able to find your friend and I'll help you. Yoimiya, does this mean that you can- Sorry, I don't know if I can. I've only just arrived in Sumeru. Maybe I haven't seen one yet, but that doesn't matter. Whether I can see them or not doesn't change my- 
What do we do? Paimon really wants to help her. She didn't deserve any of this. Not her illness, or being separated from her friend, but... Huh? Me? Sure. Um, sorry. Wait here for a moment. I'll be right back. What's wrong? You look so serious all of a sudden. Oh, did you think I was overpromising back there? Don't worry, to her, reuniting with her R&R &R friend is the result. But recapturing her past joy and belief in herself is... I'm guessing that her sudden illness made her feel like she may not be able to realize her dreams anymore. It... Oh, everyone has their own imagination. After some chance... Co so as long as we help her rediscover that same feeling she once had, her R&R will return... Oh, so that's why... Adults only want to believe in objective reality. In doing so, they may unintentionally do But I think there are ways to get even subjective things back. So, how about it? What? <laughs> Looks like all this excitement made you forget your... <sighs> if we didn't do anything to help, and would the stars really want their caller to have such a heartless soul? What are you... Because we can actually summon the Aranara. <laughs> Just watch! We have some tricks up our sleeve. Whoa! So, this is an Aranara. the one who should be apologizing. Sorry, uh, let me explain. I know that you only want to be seen by people you trust. It's rash of me, but this girl once had an Aranara as her best friend, and they she's been quite ill, and her world has been turned upside down. It's been so long since she's been able to see her parting with a friend like that is too sad, and she never wanted... That's why I want to help her. Her world is still very small. Too small. As things are, all she can do is sit alone. Yes. Maybe we're already used to bad luck and we know how to deal with feelings of sorrow and disappointment. But this is her first time dealing with any of this. Life is for us to support. Huh? What do you mean by this? So, that- uh, Thank you! Thanks for trusting us. again. My heart? Huh? He's gone just like that? It looks like this guy here has... My heart. <laughs> huh? at all a and it didn't feel weird I I wait so that means we're not our first time in one <sighs> no wonder our apurva said not to worry avin can move wow that's amazing how amazing now we can 
can all come on. Let's race. Let me see how good you. I, I might not have recovered yet. Whatever. Let's go. Ah, and off she goes. Well, this was easy. I meant that she'd need more time. <laughs> That's true. Let's catch up. Run any further, you would have caught a feeds toe to toe with you, Mia! I've outran lots of adults before. Uh, long legs don't necessarily mean you run. <laughs> I won't even be able to compete with you in a. Hmm, let's see. Where should we go next? <gasps> Look! Something's floating up ahead! Does it want us to follow it? Hmm, maybe. Want to keep chasing after it? You're not feeling worn out yet? Getting tired is part of running, and I love everything about running. Mushrooms here. They're big enough to lie on. That's not what they're for. Let me show you. Oh, it's what for jumping? Watch this. So, this is our destination? But I'm so happy. I hope, you know, at first, it felt like, but as long as, even though. I don't know how- Oh, that's not important. What's important is that you've remembered our memories don't just symbolize our past. It can also shine a light in our future. Once you find the hope in your heart again, that happiness will come back to you. Yes. Thank you, you and Mia. Let's keep looking for our Shani. It doesn't look like- Yeah. Uh, then why would the star lead us here? I don't know how to explain this. Almost like it- I know. Could this stone be your earth stone? Uh, earth stone? It's a very rare ore that symbolizes a person's aspirations and dreams. Since you can see it, that... is that how it? It's just like in fairy tales. I thought, but I'm glad that I found that belief again. them. The 
R and R is sure of a flair for magical journeys. They not only helped Devin find her best friend, but they also showed us what an Earthstone is. Oh, uh, we have to look for one of our own later to make the purest lens. Yep. Hmm. It's kind of funny, but Paimon thinks we can actually do it. But we have to bring her back to Sumeru City first. <sighs> her mother must be worried sick. <laughs> It... The dream ended. We dreamed a most lovely dream. Don't look so lonely. He's right next to you. Arshani, you're still here. It's okay. I understand. But... I think I understand now. Yoe Mia's right. Everyone gets thanks for helping me rediscover. <laughs> You've also helped us a lot, so don't be so humble. To be honest, we didn't know where to start with Earthstone. But now that we're on this track, I think we'll find it. Yoe Mia, you need this Earthstone because. Yep. Oh, once we find it, if that's helping, I'm happy to lend you my. Did you just take glasses out of your chest? <laughs> How'd you know we... I didn't. I just thought that since you helped me find my precious friend, and then the light turned into this. Thank you. I didn't expect us to solve our problem like this. I'll... Not that I know how to use it, but let's see what my... Where are you? Where are you? Oh, I think I see it! Oh, it was, uh, pretty obvious. Come on, I'll lead the way. Once we're done watching the meteor shower, I'll also thank you for helping us. Uh, actually, let me scrap the pleasantries. You all are great storytellers.
already? But Paimon wants to watch more. The meteors we summoned flew up from the ground. They were exactly like fireworks. Ugh, I could have kept watching that forever. That was the realest, grandest, most magical dream. Paimon, too! Paimon didn't expect you to just pull us onto that shooting star. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't think about it at all. I just thought it'd be a shame if we didn't try something crazy. <laughs> you know me. It really doesn't matter. I really should thank you two, though. You set all this up as a backup plan because you knew that Meteor Sh- Don't worry. I loved it so, so, so much. I- Oh, whew. That's good. Paima- Why would I be? I dreamed about helpful, friendly, cute Aranara. I dreamed that we ran and jumped atop large mushrooms and we discovered Earthstone in a- And when I thought we had woken up, the next part was even from her heart, a fiend brought forth earthstone glasses. We found meteors that flew up from the earth. And we even became one with the shooting stars themselves. That's right. Dreams themselves may be imaginary, but if we were sticklers about truth and fiction, we would have missed out on so... <laughs> you sure know your way with words. Paimon's gonna bump you up a few places on the Paimon um, by the way, the Aranara, they don't usually... Oh, yeah! They're so cute! We... The wood carvings? Yeah! If we hadn't seen those wood carvings, then we wouldn't have dreamed of such cute... Huh. <laughs> don't worry, I know. I think they're... Fi well, it's almost time. Sumeru, such you will always be welcome here. A it's a deal. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> you you and Mia. Before you go back, I want to tell you about my new dream. I want to travel to Inazuma on my own. Wow, that's impressive. <laughs> I didn't expect to be... Don't worry. I'll make you some fireworks. You do as well. No matter how busy your adventures get, remember, you gotta come and watch the fireworks this meteor shower inspired. Sounds like a plan. I will, I will. <laughs> oh yeah! By the way, have a look at this. That's right, this is the one you helped me pick. And you said it looked kind of like me. I went to buy another. Look at it whenever you're feeling down. Who knows? Maybe, of course, meeting in person is still better. <laughs> okay, I'll be heading back now. I really love the trip you prepared for me. In fact, I'm totally impressed. No matter where you two go, I know that our friendship and its warmth will support you. So, go forward. To the end of your journey, and to the ends of this world! See you around! Something on your mind again? Let's work through it together. Two heads are better than one. 